what's up welcome back to my channel i have a huge pimple there you can see it when i face that way and i'm getting more and more my uncle tom is here mother nature it's all happening i am apartment hunting today i don't know why that was so hard for me to say or why i sounded so weird saying it i have my hazards on right now because i'm like pulled over on the side of the road i just left this place um, I didn't want the lady to think I was weird sitting in my car and like talking to my camera. I feel like I'm gonna be on time to every single one today and that's a nice feeling because I'm usually late and running around and stressing and today I'll probably be able to like actually chill while doing this which will hopefully make it a little bit more enjoyable. I want to live in the city for a little bit even if I can only afford it for one year. Um, I want to do it while I'm young and like, you know, before one day I'm married and like starting a family and it's not like city material, even though I would still be so down, but like you, you get what I'm saying. Um, so yeah, I, that's why everything is so expensive. Also, I'm working in the city, so makes sense to live in the city. I don't want to have to drive super far for work every day. But yeah, um, I'm gonna go ahead and go into the leasing office and show you guys the outside of the building. So, yeah. Okay, so this is the outside of Camden at Bellevue. Here's the leasing center. And like, I don't know if you guys can see, but there's apartments like all over the place that i was just at is only 13 minutes from here so let's go inside It is so hot outside. My friends in Arizona are probably like, girl, do not say that. This place um, was smaller than the other place and it's the same price, but they have um, free covered parking, like garage parking. And um, you also get like a balcony and the one, um, that I saw today is smaller, so I would be getting the bigger one for the same price. Um, and they have like a gym, a pool and all of that, but she forgot to show me, it's okay. Um, I honestly forgot to ask about it as well. So, yeah, now I have like, a little bit of time hold on okay so I had some time and I actually just remembered that I had another place that I wanted to see and we were emailing so I just called them and like confirmed and I'm gonna head there these places are like we can only hold these prices for 48 hours so I need to figure it out like today and tomorrow um, 
I wish that I could have this video up and edited by then so that everyone else could help me too, but it's just not gonna happen. And you guys probably honestly aren't gonna see <laughs> me in my apartment for a minute because of all these apartment hunting videos, there's like, I don't know, four or five in total now. At, well, once they're all, what the F? That's so annoying. What the F? What the actual F? I think it's because I put like a pimple cream on and I think that the, oh no, I think that the pimple cream, I think I'm making it worse. I don't know. It just like doesn't work well with foundation. Damn, that sucks. But I'm gonna go ahead and head to the next place. I really should not get a coke but your girl needs a coke i am hungry and thirsty and i have water i should drink my water but i'm gonna drink my water until i get my coke the outside of the tangent apartments yeah Okay, so the place that you guys just saw is called Tangent, and that um, floor plan you just saw is 750 feet, and she said um, that I don't have to make a decision in 48 hours. She said to take my time. Um, prices change all the time, so she, like, and all the units are different prices, so she can't, like, quote me an actual price, but she said that right now everything is typically around the price of like $1,400, but she thinks she saw one for like $1,300. Um, and then utilities and electric here is cheaper than the others, so that's really nice. Um, she said 60 to 80, and if it's just literally one person, it's probably more on the 60-ish side. Um, they do only, like the windows are big, as you saw, um, but they only have like two lights in the living room slash kitchen and um, not, well in this one they had one light in the ba the bedroom and a light in the, in the bathroom. Um, but she said that they just, you know, try to avoid putting a lot of lights in because they have the big windows and they want to help us you know, the residents save on um, electricity. So that's also pretty cool. They have a parking garage, but that's an additional $115 every month. That's expensive. Um, and they have like a tiny dog run and they have like a gym and a pool, but I've got to say, I don't know. The last one I think is out of my list because I don't want carpet in the living room. I just don't. My next appointment is literally in an hour and a half. I have no idea what I'm gonna do until then, but yeah, I will see you guys then. Okay, so I'm doing a self-guided tour and this is the first one that I'm going to look at. That's the floor plan. It's a little small. Um, 
and I don't know about the price. <laughs> it's a little high. Okay, cool. Um, I think online I was really looking for stuff that was more so $1,400 if unless they have a deal. Okay, so she said it should be unlocked. And let's see. Oh. Okay, so far pretty nice. So we have a water heater here. Oops. And full size washer and dryer. I guess this would be considered an urban um, apartment because there's no door on the bedroom. Um, <clears throat> the closet is not that big. And there is no window in the bedroom, which I don't like. Um, there is a ceiling fan, so that's nice. And this is nice. Those are that those fancy things. And then I guess this would be where the living room and dining area are, but wow, this is very small. My stuff won't fit in here. Um, and there is all of the kitchen stuff and the appliances. And I love that this is on the highest floor. Um, here's a better window. Looks like there's the pool. This is, oh hey, this is like super in the city. Um, it's pretty nice, but very small. Here's the restroom. I like the mirror. It's nice and lit up. Countertops are pretty nice. A little extra storage, and then the bathroom. So here is the second one. Again, you have your little temperature thing. Bathroom. It's not bigger and it's too small. So, okay, so I am at the next place already, um, and the one that you guys just saw was Madera Cap Hill. Um, I was walking in with somebody who, like, said their friend lived there. And we were on the elevator together and I asked like, does your friend like it here? And they said, it's really nice. Like the apartments are really nice, but um, management is not good. His friend had an apartment or had a problem with something leaking in their closet. Like what? And then all of their stuff like got wet because management was like taking their time or like, I don't know. I don't know the whole story, but you know, those are things to consider when moving into a place. Um, but I also just think that, you know, the places I looked at earlier, like exactly what I'm looking for. I just think that I can get something bigger and like maybe not nicer, but actually I think probably nicer. Like the very first apartment I looked at today was awesome. Like 
I loved it there and those windows were great. Um, I didn't like in the last one, the first one that we saw at the last one, there was like zero room for, like my furniture wouldn't fit in there. And the second one, my couch is too big again, like. I want to have like a full living space and like that's another thing about like getting older and like moving around you like every time I feel like um, when you move into a new place you always buy something new and you just start to accumulate stuff and like eventually like a studio is going to be too small like I cannot live in a studio um, because I have too much stuff and I don't want to sell my furniture because I worked really hard to pay for that stuff so yeah but um this place is park at Canyon Ridge it's in Aurora Colorado I can't remember the prices oh wait actually I wrote it down I have my like notebook here um, it's $13.71 and then about $100 a month per or for utilities. I'm excited to see. I am enjoying looking at apartments. It's still a little overwhelming, but fun because it's exciting to like choose the next place that I'm going to live. Yeah. All right. So let's go in. walls come painted like this or is that just for the model? So I just looked at this place, obviously you guys saw it as well, um, I, this one's out 100%, it's way too small, like all of my furniture is too big for that place and that kind of sucks, it's not really far, it's like 20 minutes away from like the downtown Denver area. I would just like something a little bit closer, I am really stuck on the first one that I saw this morning and I think I might get it, I'm so excited about it. <laughs> 